My name is Scott Miller. Uh, I live here in Missoula, Montana, and I have a show opening up at the MAM. I was interested in art from a very early age. I can even remember as far as first grade, just uh, being very interested in the art classes that were going on, something that I just gravitated towards. I always just had a great time with it, and uh, always knew once I hit high school even that that's what I wanted to pursue. My dad came from sort of a drafting background, and so he really encouraged that. And uh, even though it was different, it was similar drawing skills. And uh, so I felt feel fortunate that I had that in my family. Yeah. I did have art in school. I did take a few art classes around town, some lo other local artists. Uh, watercolor people mostly at the time, uh, that was about it. Uh, I started working at Marie's Arteries, which was a uh, uh, framing and art store here in town, and that in those days it was really the only one other than the bookstore. I went to Pratt Institute, which oh. is located in Brooklyn, New York, which is a design school and probably top three in the nation. Uh, I was on scholarship, uh, that helped a lot, otherwise I probably wouldn't have been able to go, uh, it was pretty expensive. Um, so I did that for four years there and lived in New York for a total of 20 years oh. and moved back here in 2005. While I was at school, I, I did illustration. That was uh, my major, and uh, so I did that, along with many other things, but uh, including books, uh, newspaper, other magazine, and eventually uh, uh, getting to be a cover artist up at New Yorker for several years, which was a, a huge break for me. I really... Uh, found that on my walks throughout town here at nighttime, how Missoula just really lit up um, and the color really came alive here. And also just doing some research and not seeing that around in the art world here uh, sort of led me in that. I actually did do an illustration job for the Clark Fork Coalition here in town, uh, which sort of started this whole series off which was, um, again, the answer to the, that solution was the river. Uh, I thought it really showed up best at nighttime with the reflection of the lights. And then that sort of just sparked off this whole idea of doing all of these downtown Missoula night scenes. I specifically wanted to concentrate on the downtown as a whole, not any one street or any one building, but as a group and trying to uh, you know, step back from the city in that way and see it as a whole rather than, um, you know, specific points of it. Uh, well, my advice to anybody out there uh, that wants to get into the art world is just continue uh, doing art if that's what you like to do. D don't be afraid uh, and just do it. 